So some of the common areas that we're going to be looking for cracks or that we find cracks would be down at the drain because maybe the drain pipe wasn't put deep enough into the soil or they didn't compact the soil well enough and we have depression in the soil below the pool. Steps is another area where you'll commonly find cracks uh, where we have ornamental plants and planters around a pool. Sometimes the root systems are invasive and will come in and, and crack the pool. Another thing that we want to look for is any erosion, any deterioration of the plaster surface which could uh, show signs of an aging pool or a pool that's being overchlorinated. If you start to see the gunite beneath the pool surface, that could indicate that we're in need of a full resurface of the pool. And as I glance around the pool and looking into the spa, I can see some degradation on the plaster. So that's an indication that this, we're starting to see wear and tear on the plaster, maybe some sun damage, maybe some overchlorination of the pool. This looks like we're in need of some repairs over here at the spa. Another thing we want to look for is any rust spots in the pool, in the bottom of the pool surface. Rust could indicate a few things. It could indicate that some of the tie wire that was used to build the cage for the pool, all the rebar, the structural steel, some of the steel has come up some of the tie wires have come up through the plaster and now they're starting to rust. 